don't jump. Please, not here. Parker Industries is just a few blocks down. That's the sort of address you fling yourself to death at. You, you're making jokes? I was bitten by a sad radioactive clown. Get off! Hasn't this place seen enough tragedy? Ultron went ham before I even had the chance to trash my own building. It doesn't need your wandering soul ghosting the crap out of it. So yeah, I'm sure a real superhero would have something profound to say to make yourself feel instantly better, but I'm all you got. I'm Deadpool. What's your- Don't. Don't what? Don't pretend to care. You're being presumptuous. I don't care yet. You're making it awfully hard for me to get my care on. Is it a boy? A girl? Money? Did you marry a succubus and she might ruin your life? Are you trying to make me jump? No, never. Though I have been told I make people very uncomfortable. Well, again, Parker Industries is right over there. I hate you. I think that's a sign that you're on the mend. I'll make you an offer. If you're determined that this is going to be your last night on Earth, what do you want to do? Have you seen Hamilton yet? You're a maniac. What is wrong with you? No, I haven't seen it. And anyway, aren't tickets like a million dollars and impossible to get? Don't worry. I know a guy with tickets. I can't believe you. Are they going to be okay? I said I knew a guy with tickets. I didn't say you would give them to us. And don't worry about these two. They're manslaughtering the slumlords. Just shut up. See? I had a blast. Who knew the Founding Fathers were all dope? Where to now? Parker Industries Observation Deck? Ha! You made a joke. Wait, are you not joking? Did I take a header off your roof back there and I'm in hell? Well, now that you mention it, I just saw a musical and there aren't 72 virgins lining up to meet my Deadpool. So, yeah, maybe? Let's cut the shit. Are your problems anything that require punching? I don't know. I know what you're going to say. Violence doesn't solve everything. You're terrible at guessing what people are going to say. Violence solves everything, especially if you're good at it. Listen, the night is still young. Every day the Avengers Unity Squad gets a sack of mail from people looking for help. That's how I knew about the aristocrats in there. I keep ones that are worthy of pro bono beatings. And whenever I'm feeling down, I grab a fistful of sorrow and head into the night to crush bad people. Make rounds with me. Why won't you just leave me alone? Unless this is a kidnapping. How dare you? I only kidnap for money. I promise I'll let you go if you do everything I say. Oh my god, you are kidnapping me. What's your name? Danielle. Oh, thank god. I was worried you were Robin. Okay, Danielle. I'm going to teach you how to breach the door of a real tyrant. I got several letters about this Jordan Hart. He's been robbing his elderly neighbors to feed a nasty drug habit. Hola, sexy maids. Now, when you see the people go dark, you knock the hell out of the door. Knock, knock, heart. Did we just steal a motorcycle? I don't know. Did we? What does your heart tell you? Come on. We had fun, right? Aren't you glad you picked my address to fail to off yourself at? Yeah, sure. But I think you have a pretty good handle on things without me. Like the rest of the world? You can let me off anywhere. No, I can't. I'm smart enough to know that I'm dumb enough that I can't help you. But they can. You promised to let me go! I am. This is where you and I part ways. I've been texting the staff. They're expecting you. What if I don't want to go inside? Are you going to make me? I... I don't know. I don't think I'll have to, because I think you want to walk in. Will you walk in with me? Listen... I don't think you're crazy. You just need a little help. And I am not the guy to help you. (sighs) I'm killing someone who's way harder than what I usually do. Of course, the moment she walks out of my life, I think of the perfect advice. You gotta remember, no matter how bad things get, that life is fluid. There's always the chance that something great is waiting right around the next corner. You just have to find a way to keep rounding corners.